Hello everyone, welcome to Aptitude Jab. This is a set based on seating arrangement. It says that there are nine friends. They are seated around a circular table and they were playing a game of cards and each one was holding a single card having a number from 2 to 10, not necessarily in that same order. Okay, so uh, there are two things in this. One is the arrangement plus the cards that they have. Okay, so there are nine people around this circle and we need to find the card that they were holding. Okay, so we have five, six, seven, eight, nine. All right, so let us first think about the cards that they have. So we have to do two things. We have to arrange them as well as we need to put the number of cards. So let us do the uh, numbering thing first, then we can probably arrange them. Uh, it says E and B had cards whose product was equal to the product of D's and C's cards. So these people are A to I. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H and I. It says that E and B, they had cards whose product was equal to D and C. So E into B is D into C. Okay. At the same time, we are given that D and C had even numbered cards. So D and C are even. B had a card that was twice of C's card number. Okay. So let us make two cases. So B is equal to two times of C. So if we take C is equal to 2, C is an even number. So if we take C is equal to 2, B should be 4. Okay. And uh, if we take C is equal to 4, B will be 8. And we cannot have anything beyond this. Okay. So uh, it is 2, 4 or 4, 8. We cannot have C, 3. So these are the possibilities. Okay. Uh, the person, so okay, this is a lowest card. D is at 4 to the left of C. Sum of their card was equal to the card number of F. So D plus C is equal to F. That is also given to us. G had a smaller card than E. So G is less than E. And then we have uh, 3 percent, 7 and 5, fine. I had a card number greater than that with B. So I is greater than B. So that is, that are the conditions that are given to us. Now using these numbers, let us try to identify what could be these products. Okay. Now E into B is D into C. Okay. Now if we have, uh, like if we see that D is even, so D can be 6, 8 or 10. Okay. So D is even. So D cannot be 2, 4. It could be 6, 8, 10. Okay. Now E into B is D into C. So uh, D into C will be 12. So in this case, E will be 3. Okay. And in this case, if we talk about 8, so this is 16. So C, uh, then e, e into B is D into C. So 16, 16, 4 though not possible. Okay. So 8 is not possible for D because if we put 8, this is 16 and 4 into 4 not possible because all are distinct. But if it is 10, so 10 into 2, 20. So E will be 4 in that scenario. Okay. All right. So that is one more thing. Now it says that G is less than E. So if we consider E is equal to 3, G cannot be less than C because minimum is 2, 2 to 10. So G, it, this case is also not possible. Right? So one case is possible as this. And uh, in that case, G will be equal to 3 because it says that uh, G is less than E. So only number possible less than E is 3. Okay. Uh, we take 3 and then uh, let us add others also. D plus C is equal to F. D plus C is coming as 12. So not possible. Right. So this case is eventually not possible because it does not satisfy all these criteria. So we have this as the condition that B is equal to 8 and C is equal to 4. Okay. Now we have B is equal to 8 and C is equal to 4 and we need to satisfy this condition also. So D is an even number. So we can have D is equal to 2, right? If we put D is equal to 2, D into C is equal to 8, E cannot be 1. E cannot be 1. So D cannot be 2. So we can have D, C or D is equal to 10. Okay. So let's take both the cases. If D is equal to 6, in that case, DC is 24. So E turns out to be 3 in this scenario. And uh, if we take 10, then E turns out to be 5 because E into B is 
uh, e into b dc dc is 24 so 24 8 into 3 if it is 40 8 into 5 okay now if you take other things d plus c is equal to f anyway this is not possible because if you take d10 this is not possible right d plus c is f so we cannot take this case as well so the only case that we will get is 6 and 3 because d plus c this also should satisfy this also should satisfy so d plus c is equal to f so f is 10 and g is less than e so e is 3 so the only possible value here is 2 all right now we have placed 2 3 4 we are left with 5 and 7 and then another one is 9 Achha, b i is greater than b b is 8 so i can only be 9 because 10 is already f and then we are left with two values which are 5 and 7 and we do not have any other information about the numbers so let us put a and h 7 and 5 for now okay for now let us put that on hold because we do not get any concrete information further so next step that we should do is we should try to make the arrangement okay all right so these are uh, statement based statement based arrangement based b uh, b and c were sitting together b and c sitting together so we can have either b and c like this or we can have d and c like this now let us see who are arranged according to b and c uh, so it says that d sat fourth to the left of c and i was seated third to the left of b okay so if i say that uh, if we consider this scenario okay if we consider this scenario let us say this one d is four to the left of c so one two three four this should be d and i sat third to the left of b so b one two three this comes as both i and d right so this is not possible because we cannot have two people at the same position so if we are considering this i and d are clashing with each other so this means b and c are together in this way b is to the right of c now we can put i and d comfortably i was seated third to the left of b so one two three this is i and d is four to the left of c so one two three four this is d okay then we have uh, h was to the immediate right of f so we have f and h like this and we have something else uh, the person with the lowest card was second to the left of h so lowest card is 2 which is g so g is second to the left of h so we have g f and h in this order okay g f and h from left to right so G, F and H we can place only in this position. G, F and H, right? So only in these three positions we can place them, right? So now we are left with two more positions which are uh, A and E. So these are among A and E. And let's see whatever, uh, what, what all information this, we have used this, we have used this okay g had a smaller numbered card this has also been done now there is one thing which is given so it says three persons were seated between the persons having card numbers seven and five when counted in a clockwise manner from the person having card number five so card seven and five are a and h and there are three persons between seven and five in clockwise manner okay so let us say if we take this case as a uh, 5 when counted from the person having card number 5. Suppose we say that H is card number 5. So 1, 2, 3, this should be 7. It says that 3 persons seated between. Now this is not possible. Right? This does not uh, seem possible because we know that C is 4. So this means H is not 5, H is 7. And there are 3 persons between A and H when counted clockwise from A. So 1, 2, 3, this must be A. Now if you see this, this is the clockwise direction and three people in between one two three and this is h so this is your correct arrangement so this is a and then eventually this will be 
E and we know the numbers also now. So H is seven, A is five, and we can make the arrangements like I is nine, and then E is uh, three, D is six, seven, F is ten, G two, B eight, and C four. So this is how we will have the arrangement, right? So it satisfies all the conditions. Now let us look at the questions. What is the card number which H? So we can say that this is 7. Who are sitting adjacent to A? So this is A. A K adjacent are I and C. Who was holding card number 9? So card number 9 is with I. Okay. So this is uh, I in this. And who was, uh, what was the position of E with respect to F? E with respect to F. This is E. This is F. So this is first second third so this is the right side they are facing inside so first second third third to the right is the correct answer so that is the solution to the set and the answers to the questions